Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Security Chief Anderson. Ah, uh, and it mutated. Alright, we had to go with the criticals on this one. But he's down. No point in leaving that for the scavenger. Looks like we're clear. Let's move out, Yellow Jacket. All right, now clear the rubble. Like that makes sense. How to do it? I guess what this rubble here. Sure, that's the rubble. They might mean yeah, this rubble here. So. You aren't what I was expecting. You do have a pit boy. You're from a vault, but you're clearly not. Wait, who is that over there on the what left? What are you doing here? Why did you help me? Are those your friends? What? Those look like feral ghouls. Okay. Anyhow, I heard the vault tech radio beacon, and I came. Those intruders must have triggered it by attempting to force the main door. I wasn't actually expecting anyone to answer it. After all this time, my name is Valerie Barstow, and I was to be the overseer of this vault. But please, follow me. I have a proposal for you. It's been a hard 200 years. I was giving a tour of what was to be my pride and joy. Okay, do you see my those feral ghouls, ghouls over there? Really? Earthquakes. Sirens. Many died. Perhaps they were lucky. The radiation. They must be Somehow, friends of yours because they're not attacking us. Julian. Oh no, I here they come. Sorry. What the Stop. hell? What did my grass fire? Jeez. What? Alright, I don't even know what just happened. Jeez, he's getting whooped up on, that's all. Alright. Between Preston and me. Whoa, we've got more. Let's go for that glowing one first. Let's take out these legs. Oh shit, I only got one. One. Hold up. Wow. One action point. Come on, recharge. Going for the legs again. Wow, that thing is resistant. Okay, he's down. And 
He's dead. Um, wait, is Barstow dead? Holy show, no. No. <laughs> oh. Oh my god, no. I got Wow, no. We need her for the Oh my god. I mean cuz there are missions and all this kind of stuff. I don't believe I don't even know what happened. It's like I was shooting at the thing and then there were explosions and wow. Well, you know what, guys? We got to go back to an earlier save. We it's this can't end like this. Whoa. All right. Well, we will be back. All right, and we're back. The overseer died in our uh, last episode and uh, this is take two because we need her in order to further the story so instead of talking to her now I'm just gonna go ahead and take out these ghouls because they were the respo responsible for her death somehow now she's down this Julianne person who else Let the overseer stay over there so that she's safe. Actually, let's go for the leg. sure this area is secured. I am not going to have this uh, overseer killed again. All right, looks like it's safe. You aren't what I was expecting. You do have a pit boy. You're from a vault. But you're clearly not with Waltec. What are you doing here? Why did you help me? Well... I guess, you know, the thing that I'm puzzled about right now is I guess feral ghouls don't attack these types of human ghouls, if you want to call them that. I didn't know that. But anyhow, um, yeah, it was the radio beacon. I heard the vault radio beacon, and I came. Those intruders must have triggered it by attempting to force the main door. I wasn't actually expecting anyone to answer it. After all this time, my name is Valerie Barstow, and I was to be the overseer of this vault. But please, follow me. I have a proposal for you. It's been a hard 200 years. I was giving a tour of what was to be my pride and joy. My vault. Then, the earthquakes. Sirens. Many died. Perhaps they were lucky. The radiation. Somehow, I was spared. I'm sorry. The construction crew didn't fare as well as me. They've never done anything hostile towards me, though. It's probably best if you put them out of their misery. Uh, yeah, they're already dead. 
I'll wait for you to finish. You will wait for me to finish? Really? Aren't they all dead? Okay, I guess there must be some it's more back here. better to put the board. Alright. Oh, there is. Look. And my favorite type of ghoul, too. only that one left. I tried digging my way to the entrance. With that control board, I could have changed everything. But there was simply too much trouble for the equipment to handle. But my work kept me going. Here, among these papers, is my life's work. I'd like to share it with you. Dr. Braun tasked me with something vital. A series of prototypes and their related... Well... Experiments... That could redefine society. But, as you can see... Things did not go according to plan. Sounds like you've had a pretty... Tough time. I've had many dark days down here. Even despair. But the work. Always the work sustained me. This vault was meant to be spacious, full of trained staff, trusted subordinates and scientists. Despite how things have played out, I see opportunity. Let us work together, as partners. <laughs> Ask for money. I'll, I'll never, never work with vault work with vault -Tec. Oh, man. Okay, so... Do I want to expel her? Then no. Wow. At least, at least they warn you that, you know, taking this choice is, is gonna, um... Wow. Okay, so what's my role? What's my role? I recognize that you are in a superior bargaining position. I'll handle the mundane nuts and bolts of vault management. Anything you want, I'm happy to accommodate. All I ask is you run the prototype experiments. Let's do this, then. Good. Excellent. We cannot begin until I have my overseer's desk to run the experiments. The information in the desk's terminal will prove vital. I entrust you with the future of our vault. Vault 88. Okay, so here we are. We have met the Overseer, discovered Vault 88. We're going to um, end the uh, video here.